Right, you used to build your vegetable man and Jake's gonna build his. Okay? okay? I'm gonna do like short ones. Okay. You've done, your, you've done your drawing there, so that's good, Ethan. Are you going to start off with small legs this time? Yeah? Ooh, you going to do the big ones? Okay. Big ones are good fun. What do you need, Dijek? I need an apple. We need an apple. Very good. I need another take Ethan. <laughs> Ethan. Don't argue, please. Not on the camera. Why are you still on? Oh, that's lovely, Jake. Ooh, very nice. Want tomato eyes? Some eyebrows. Oh, some eyebrows. Grips are going to be the eyebrows. Will I do one too? Can I use these feet? Yeah, big. Big. You need the ugly. This is just going to be like. Is it um, or yours going to be? Yours going to be. Mine's is going to be like just a crazy alien one. I think the eyebrows, the eyebrows look weird. Um, okay. This looks weird. Wait. We show my my show. Actually, really enjoy this, don't they? <laughs> <laughs> Brilliant, and I know you've done your drawing and all, Ethan. That's great. I'm not done yet. I'm not done finished. yet. You're finished. There should be a sketch pad you can get in, and Dad. <sighs> Plus, where does it have a group spot? Ta da! Jake, <laughs> <laughs> go, ta da! <laughs> you ready? No. No. Oh. Okay, is that us? Yeah. <laughs> Hello everyone, welcome to Sketching Sundays. Um, this week we are going to look at the work of artist Giuseppe Archibald. So he is an Italian artist um, and as you can see in the little video before, we were playing around with some vegetables, a little bit of fruit. Um, we were just taking a little bit of inspiration from his artwork. So this is his lovely, beautiful collage. And he would have done lots and lots of portraits of different people. And he loved to have a lot of fun in his work. And I think this week is going to be about an awful lot of fun. Having fun with our, making our vegetable people making our vegetable art um, and it's October so it's a nice thing to think about we're getting a little bit more um, ready for say harvest and things like that so let's get sketching okay so let's if you start looking at this artwork you'll see more and more vegetables so I'm just gonna I'm just gonna have a little bit of fun I'm just gonna draw some vegetables so this I think is the bottom of some sort of watermelon now I just wondered should I bring you a little bit closer? Actually I think I should. Okay, hold on. Ooh. Big beams in here. There we go. That's us. Alright. Oh, there we go. Now yes, that's a good bit closer. So we can do our vegetable man or woman or animal, whatever way you want to do your little project this week. You can. Okay, here's another plum. So you could do your favorite vegetables. Or you could do maybe vegetables you don't like, might be nice too. So yes, what did we say we could make it into a man or boy or girl or dog or anything. Just have a bit of fun with this vegetable harvest project. So 
so my boys love doing this today. We can have a lot of fun, doing a lot of funny faces. There we go, so there's an apple up there, some more berries. Sort of reminds me of those lovely big hats that are full of lots of fruit, tropical kind of feel. Now let me see, so let's put some eyebrows on. Now the eyebrows are actually little bits of corn. What a fun artist Giuseppe was. He was a Spanish artist and he had a, he made a lot of fun with his artwork. And he was a funny guy as well. There's some eyes popping out. Now I think we have done this project before with maybe some of my followers in other classes maybe, but I just thought it was so fun to do it again for all the new people that has joined in. Every week we are getting more and more people watching the videos. Oh my goodness, yes, so it's a big pair for a nose. Starting to look good now. Big pear. And they've got actually some monkey nuts, it looks like. For a moustache. And we've got little teeth, which are little berries. Uh huh. And more little berries, and another little sort of plum here. I'm not sure what this is, but it's kind of fluffy. Some sort of hairy fruit, maybe it's a kiwi. And then he's got a big beard, which again looks like some sort of corn. Now, might take you guys a little bit long to colour him in. But what lovely colours you can find in what I've been calling the vegetable man. And sometimes I think this is the best way to really understand what is going on in a painting to really study it and really look. These are lovely leeks, spring onions. So I have a picture just here of um, our vegetable man, but you could also research Giuseppe Archibald yourself and find lots and lots of his work. And you could look at it in more detail, or you could make it a little bit more simpler. Maybe you could just do the vegetable making, which is really fun. But please send me your pictures. I love to see them every week. So we've got a little bit of a pumpkin put on down here. And then some really lovely flowers. Lots of nice things going on in this lovely, beautiful artwork. Okay, so I look forward to seeing all of your vegetable people or animals or anything you want to make out of vegetables. It'll be a lot of fun. Okay, thank you. Bye.